and welcome back. <laughs> Sam and I are on our way to a really fun day. We're gonna meet up with Birdie Gray. Yes. And we're gonna check out bridesmaids dresses because if you didn't know, Sam is one of my bridesmaids. Yes, and she's one of mine. So this is kind of perfect that we get to go together. So I'll try on like whatever she wants me to try on for her day. <laughs> She'll try on what I pick. I haven't picked a color yet. I know, um, mine's happening sooner. Yeah, hers is happening but way sooner. It's kind of cool because you guys, like I get to pick what bridesmaid dresses your girls are wearing. I know. And you get to for me. <laughs> So we're, <laughs> we're making all the decisions for yeah. everyone. Yeah. So I can't wait to get there. I can't wait to check out the birdie gray dresses. Oh and my gosh, they're stunning too. So that's gonna be fun. I'll see you guys when we get there. much fun so <laughs> I just tried on dresses for Sam since I'm gonna be a bridesmaid I just tried on a bunch of different styles and colors and oh my god literally everything looks so good so you guys are gonna see Sam try on dresses for my bridesmaids and you're gonna see how pretty these dresses are like they're insanely beautiful they just and they're so flattering you guys so yeah I, I don't want to show her yet because she has a she has one that I really like but you feel so good in them they're so pretty and literally there's a style for every single body type like whatever one of your bridesmaids style wants or you want there's a style here for you sam is getting zipped up in dress number one color number one i haven't decided what color i want because i like all the pink family so i haven't decided if i want like taupe or blush or mauve so once i see it on sam it'll give me a better idea it already looks so pretty <gasps> that looks so pretty on you sam Oh my god. So it's Melissa's day, but I hope she picks this color. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the rose quartz, which I really, really like. I love this. And it looks so good on you. And these sleeves are like really in right now. A lot of dresses have Uh huh. Those are my favorite little sleeves. Wow, so pretty. How do you feel in it? I love this one. And it has pockets. Yes, Melissa's all about the pockets. I love that because you guys can put like your lip gloss in there or your phone. phone a speech, a anything. Speech. What That's kind of jewelry would you see with this one? Like I don't know. Or a little something. You know what I see? Like tons of body shimmer mm -hmm. and like maybe like a solitaire necklace yes. like with a little stone. With a rose quartz crystal stone. Oh my god. Yeah, I so love so that. Put little I love that. I love that. So this one is a convertible dress that you can wear literally a million ways, I think. Okay. Like we've seen it in so many ways. So she's gonna put it for Sam as a strapless. And I'm obsessed with this color. This one is the color taupe. Like I just wanna show you guys a close up of this color. How do you feel in it? I love this one. I love the rose quartz color too though, so it's hard. I know, I like both those colors. I'm glad I don't have to pick. <laughs> You do, and you need to help me. You can play around with this dress in particular and just style it any way you want. So you said there's a video how to do this? Yep, we have video tutorials on the website. Oh my gosh, this looks so good on you. Wow. I love this, especially if you don't know if you want people wearing jewelry and or mm -hmm. not. Like, it gives a little something. That's really pretty. Oh my god. Look at the back with the cutout. Oh, that's pretty. Oh my god, look at the little bow. It's so pretty. So this is another color option. I just wanted to see a different color to see like if I was feeling it or not, since I'm leaning more towards pink, but this is pretty also. Jasmine vibes. I know. Right? It's very pretty. It's so good. And you can actually wear this dress, like put your arm through this. So oh, that okay. the yeah, so that the sleeves cover your arms a little bit, okay, or so you I'll can try it on like that in a second. Or you yeah. can wear it just like this. Like spaghetti. Straps. But I'm really liking it, spaghetti strap. Like this. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
I'm very pretty. They're all so pretty. So this is one of my favorite styles. It looks so simple, but you guys, even I tried this on yeah. and like there's something about it. You feel so good in it. And it has pockets. It it's just like cinches in the waist. Exactly. I think that's what does it. Like the cinching just makes you look so snatched. Yes. Yeah. This is mauve. And this what's is the style of this kind of Gwenny. Gwenny. Okay, this is the Gwenny in dark mauve, and I really love this color too now that I'm looking at it. I like it too. It's actually one of our most popular colors. Really? It is, yeah. Probably because no matter what filter they use, it's gonna look different than your dress. Mm -hmm. And also, it's time of year. Like, year round, it's, you can wear that color. Oh, yeah, so that is true. Color. As you guys saw, Sam tried on a bunch of different colors and yeah. styles, and I am in between the dark mauve color, which so crazy i didn't think i was gonna like it as much as when i finally saw it on her but then i also really love the rose quartz so thank you so yeah i don't know what i'm gonna choose but it's between those two colors You know what I'm getting? Green tea boba. A green tea boba with oat milk. My favorite. The last time I was here, I made Sam like bring me here every day. I think. Every day. Like, like every day. Like coming, she's like, yeah. I'm gonna post make it. it. <laughs> you order for me, cause you know. Okay. Final stop of the day. We're at Kate Somerville. We're gonna get facials. I'm so excited. I'm it for my oh, there you. <laughs> you guys are gonna get like double the content. Um, but yeah, we haven't had facials in forever. It is so pretty in here. Hi, Samily. Hello. Hi, Samily. These chairs are so pretty. Oh my god, this is cute. Can I turn oh, it down? You, want you can turn it down. I just had the most amazing facial. Like, look at me, I have sleepy face because I actually fell asleep because it was just so freaking amazing. If you guys have a Kate Somerville by you, you need to go get a facial there. Do you have makeup on? No. You look so great. Oh, really? Yeah. No, I feel like ugly today. I know. I Your skin looks so good. Oh, nice. I think it's that Kate Somerville you facial. You look like a baby. So we've been having, um, like, what do we call it? Just like a bridesmaid weekend. Yeah. It's Try been to fun. finalize things for our bridesmaid dresses. We each decided what we're gonna go with. The same exact dress. <laughs> Same dress. Although I think I'm gonna let my girls pick whatever style they want. But I like, you like that. What, I, what I'm wearing for yours, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna do the same color and then just let everyone pick whatever style they want. We're drinking oh, boba. I know. I'm chewing oh, as I'm drinking. Huh? Oh. I know. I'm not gonna be able to drink this because I keep chewing. But we're yeah. having matcha boba lattes with oat milk. So good. This is only my like third one this week. <laughs> <laughs> Which was better than last time? I know, I know. You had like every day. You had like you were doing two days. I have an addictive personality. Like when I like something, I have to have it every day until I'm just done with it. So one thing I wanted to end this vlog with was kind of sharing a little, I guess, wedding advice or it could be bridesmaid advice, whatever you want to share, and then I'm gonna share something too, just because I feel like a lot of people message me and they just feel like they're so stressed out with their wedding. Yes. And I feel like it shouldn't be that way. Mm -hmm. Like, I know it can get a little stressful. Like, we're all gonna have moments of trying to figure things out because I've never planned anything to this extent. So I just wanted to give a little feedback. For me, I just feel like I wanna let people know, like, you don't have to have an Instagram wedding. No, 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 yeah. no, 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 no. Cause I feel like it's very easy to get caught up in what you see online, what, like comparing yourself to other people's Instagram lives. But just remember that 
Instagram isn't always reality and we're all putting up our our literal highlights of like the best moments you want to share and don't feel pressured to have like this extravagant Instagram type of wedding I am certainly I certainly do not want to have an Instagram wedding like I don't want to go all out just because I feel like I'd rather invest in our future home instead of the wedding day even though the wedding day is really special Chris and I just want to invest more into building a life together after that but again it's up to you like if that's what you want to do do it but just don't do it only because you see other people online right. doing it yeah no seriously that's kind of my tip too i'm having a really small wedding like at the end only 50 people might be there but i'm not sure so i invited a little less than 100 and that's really helpful too like she was saying you don't have to have a pinterest wedding like a lot of these weddings are like 200 plus and like mm -hmm. everything was perfect but for us and what fit in our budget what fit in our timeline was a small wedding right. so we are going to be able to have different things that we want but Beautiful. i mean my Sorry. biggest tip does, it doesn't really go with this one but no bridezilla vibes oh yeah because then it just ruins like you don't even want to be in that mode no it ruins it for everyone it ruins it for the for the wedding party ruins it for yourself like you don't want to feel like a bride though. no you just yeah. gotta be like chill people will appreciate it i met with a planner already i met with a photographer caterer and they all said like whoa you're the chillest bride i either am like yes i can no. see that with her like i'm just like she's any so with the bridesmaid dresses i'm like which one do you like you I know? know she's so like sweet about it i just think that if you're gonna be like bridezilla then a lot of them aren't gonna want to do things for you mm -hmm. <laughs> That's another thing. Like no one's gonna want to be around you. Your bridesmaids aren't gonna want to like have special moments with you because they're afraid of you. You're ruining their lives. <laughs> and we were saying too, for us, because we're both the firstborn, that it's kind of our mom's day too. Yeah. So I want my mom to feel really special that day, and I don't want her to feel like she has to be like my assistant that day, mm -hmm. and like all this, you know, bridezilla vibes. Like I just want her to enjoy her day too, because I'm her first daughter and. It's her first wedding, and it's just exciting. Same on my side. You want them to enjoy themselves. Yeah, you want everyone to enjoy themselves. And you yourself, too. Like, you don't want to be stressed out on the wedding day. You don't want your husband to be to be stressed out. Like, I want to have fun. I'm going to have fun. Yeah. We're going to have fun I'm, in mine. Yeah, we're having fun. I'm not going to be, like, driving myself crazy, trying to get the perfect photos. I'm going to have fun. Can I drink a little? <laughs> A lot. <laughs> I don't know. So that's really just what we wanted to share with you guys. We wanted to show you our girls weekend and a little sneak peek as to what the bridesmaid dresses are going to look like and just share some wedding planning advice with you guys. If you're getting married, <laughs> comment, like. I thought you were going to say call me. If you're getting married, call me. I'm a planner now. <laughs> no, but seriously, if you guys are getting married or have been married already, comment down below. Was it a Pinterest perfect wedding? Mm -hmm. Or was it just a lot of freaking fun and everyone's still talking about your wedding? And comment like what was your favorite part of the whole process or like your actual wedding day? Yeah. I would love to know. What I just want to know, part? like get more advice for myself. So if you guys want to share some advice, leave it in the comments. We love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Fast forward 70 years later. Hi. We're planning our daughter's baby shower. You know, what, you know what's in my vlog? When we both, I was like, is this a good angle? We both like, I left out every, everything we did is all in. We were both like, <laughs> oh my God.